Greetings, everyone. Today we are at our headquarter facility in Placerville, Quebec, where we produce, assemble, and test all of our equipment before they're sent on their way to the customer. Today, uh, I'm happy to introduce you or refresh your memory about our Baylor lines, two RAM and single RAM. Before we dive into the details, our Baylor adventure started in the early 2000s with R&D, and we delivered our first single RAM Baylor in 2003. After about a decade of doing single RAM Baylor, customers started asking why we didn't produce any two RAM Baylor. A few years later, after R&D, we delivered finally our first two RAM Baylor to the market in 2012. To this day, Machine X still invests in continuous R&D to offer our customer top of the line Baylor series that suits today's MERF industry in performances and maintainability. Behind me today, we are in the final testing and assembly of one of our two RAM Baylor. Since single RAM and two RAM Baylor share a lot of similar features, let's start by exploring those features. From up here, I can introduce you to one of the primary features of both our single and two RAM Baylors. It's the pre-fill valve. It's a big conduit that you see there that links the tank to the cylinder. Due to the pre-fill valve, oil is fed to the cylinder by gravity. For that reason, on our Baylor with pre-fill, the power unit and tank needs to be mounted on top of the RAM. Prefill is a high flow direct access from the tank to the main cylinder to transfer oil faster using gravity for the portion of the cycle where full pressure is not required to move the ram and compact the material. This is available on both single ram and two ram and while allowing us to move the ram a lot faster, it also considerably reduces the electrical consumption. Also from out here, we can see that our balers has a lot of bolts on the sides. There's bolts here also on the side of the main ram. And there's those passing bit here at the bottom. They're all there and they all serve the purpose to secure our uh, bolt-on liners. And it is also a feature that is shared by both our single ram and two ram balers. Our baler features those liners almost everywhere in the baler chamber. On the floor, but also on the sides and the top of gathering and compaction areas. Since accessibility is always the key to work fast and efficiently on machines, we also came up with pretty large access doors on both sides of the machines. Even though this baler has been ordered on skates, the rollers are also another very interesting feature that is shared by our two RAM and single RAM. The rollers offers low wear on the floor and also reduce the energy consumption required by the power unit to move the RAM back and forth during the cycles. On single and two RAM, we use different shears, but they both achieve the same goal. The double V shear on the single RAM or this V serrated shear knife on the two RAM are progressively shearing the material, relieving the hydraulics from those high pressure peaks generated during the material shearing. Custom built and developed in-house, our power unit is 5,000 PSI system with variable flow piston pump. Similar to the pre-fill, the variable flow helps saving energy using the pump in their optimal pressure to flow ratio all the time during the cycles. They also allow us to power other components such as the strappers, the nutters in the process and other optional features. All of our balers offers a large 15 inch touchscreen giving the user access to all balers parameters such as pressure, RAM position, material, recipe, just to name a few. With the control, we also offer a variety of options such as remote control, bunker management, and reporting tools. Earlier, we talked about the large door to access the baler. This is the full front RAM inch door on our wide mount 2 RAM. It can open down and level with the floor so we can pull out the main RAM and eventually even the cylinder out from the front. To be able to open the front ram inch door, we remove all the four pins in the front, we can edge it down, and that's where we get full access to the rest of the components. MRF today are more and more packed with equipment, and keeping the room to remove the cylinder from the rear is not always the optimal scenario. So we offer this option in all of our wide mouth two ram configuration. This super boat right here allows the technicians that works on the baler to adjust the shear gap from the outside of the baler easily with tools that are available to almost any MRF operators. Now, let's cover a few of the single RAM features. Our patented combination of pre-press and shear, 
reduces stress on the shear, but when not required, we can disengage the pre-press and use the shear only to increase baler speed and capacity. We can always use the shear if there's any jam or the pre-press cannot complete its cycle. Another feature of our single ram baler is the horizontal tie. By opening and closing and by pushing the wires instead of pulling them, we clean the wire spit easily by pushing potential contaminants across the open tires to the ground. The mechanism then closes, tie the nut and open back up while the needles are retracted. The results is more reliable and again easier to maintain tying system. And remember, always feel free to call and talk to our experts. If you have any questions about our two RAM, single RAM, or any other balers that we manufacture, over the years, we've widened our scope of balers to narrow box, two RAM, closed door baler, DC center baler, regen instead of pre-fill. And keep in mind, we've always developed and worked on our balers with our customers to be able to adapt to the special need of our industry.